All right, people, how's it going? Good morning, good night. So basically, it's a cold day in December, and the plan for today is to try and get the car um, uncovered, uh, get it off the tender, make sure the battery's all charged, and uh, see if she wants to start up and get warm and do a little drive. guys I just did my Lotus for a photo shoot and video shoot um, and I think that's gonna come out great I'll have to edit it up and see how it looks but I'm gonna give you a little behind the scenes look here because it is a Lotus and there's always uh, something it stands for lots of trouble usually serious right um, well here's something and hopefully it's trouble but superficial <laughs> so of course while I was filming, I started the car for no particular reason. It's decided to put its check engine light on. We're in sport mode and it also has a reduced red line, around just under 5,000, like 4,800. So, don't know what that's about, but the car appears to be functioning fine. It doesn't have any stutter or anything like that, so we'll figure it out. Artificially low red line. So I've got it in sport mode. And it's right here. Just under 5,000 RPM. Any clue? Right, here I am living my uh, best life. have, which is the cheapest OBD2 sensor known to man, Oxcore MS300. We'll see if this works. Okay, so as you enter the car, um, on the driver's side, the OBD2 sensor is down towards the pedals, and then up underneath the dash, and there's actually a nice sticker here, which is actually the only way I would have found it, because it's literally up back here and I can feel it with my hands but I can't see it so it's back here somewhere I mean that's that's it I'm touching with my finger right there so all right let's get this thing hooked up all right I uh, I cleared the codes using the OBD2 reader, easy enough to do, um, especially even with this cheap little thing. Uh, it still looks like the code is pending, so I'm going to look into that a little bit more. All right, everybody. So just to finish off this episode, basically, um, I looked into the code. The P0328 represents a knock sensor code. So that's interesting. It could possibly mean some pre-detonation. This car is the naturally aspirated vehicle. Uh, it's not supercharged, so it's a little unlikely to have the pre-detonation. I have good uh, 91 um, octane gas in it. Well, I did put it in later, so it's possible that some of the, the gas had sat there for a while. It's been a month. Um, but anyway, still doesn't explain the reduced red line, and I have had that reduced red line once before, and just shutting the car off and turning it back on resolved that issue. So anyway, um, if you'd like to follow and see what happens, please subscribe and like the video if you don't mind. And uh, I'll keep you updated once I figure this all out. And I'll make a video for that. So, all right. See you, everybody.